Hello and mm. welcome back to Getting Out of the Red and this is the Torna del Inca final. There has been nothing else to report as the last game was also a live com. Here we are on, on the lineup screens, ready to go. This is the team I've picked to go out there and win the trophy for us. Restelli comes back in, in net. We have Romero, Menea and Duclos as the back three. Saluna as the wing back. Mayer in the middle and Trudeau as the left wing back. Mazurik back in the playmaker role. Canella and Landari back on the wings and Formento gets the place up front. On the bench we have Rodas, Garcia, Gilvonio, Rodriguez, Penna, Mullet and Hood. They're playing a 4-4-2. They've signed this guy, Balanta, and he looks good. They signed him for 28k, which I couldn't believe, and it's the sort of thing I think if only we had a transfer budget of some sort of number that wasn't depleted straight away, I could have bought him. 28k. Yeah. Anyway, I'm sure we'll mark him out the game. I'm going to do the opposite instructions and do the team talk, and I will see you at kickoff. Here we are at kickoff, and it is UTC's kickoff. Mayer gets it. Flings it out wide. Saluna reads the game really well, and it's out for a throw. Duclos wins the header. Chico, Gonzalez Vigil, looks for Balanta. He is surrounded by players. Prado looks wide to Bazan. Ball in and it's fallen to Balanta. Apparently Manea blocked that shot. It looked like he just put it wide. Anyway, corner to UTC. Chico will take it. Mazurdic clears it away with the head. Back to Chico. He's flung it in. Duclos wins the header. Maya picks it up for them. Landari, the great tackle. Okay, Duclos with the free kick. Up the line to Trulio. Into Landari. Over to Mazurek. Into Maya. Back to Duclos. Just keeping the ball here, Allianz Lima. Back into Maya. Mazurek. Oh, Mazurik's been fouled by Prado. Looked like that was from behind. This could be worrying for UTC. What's the ref going to do? And he sent him off. It was a tackle from behind and a pulling challenge is what they say. They revert to a 4-4-1. Okay, half an hour in. Landau at the corner. It's come to Mayer on the edge of the area. Mayer takes his time. Lays it back to Trulio. Trulio back to Mayer. Out wide to Saluna. Cross in, but it's blocked. Saluna, it comes back to him. He can hit him from this range. Mayer, Duclos. Back to Trulio. Trulio into Landari, lovely ball. Landari's got it, he holds it up, it's gone back to Romero. Out wide to Trulio. Trulio in field to Mazurek with a bit of space. Into Canella, fill it in to Formento. Beats his man, Formento, and he's taken a shot from just inside the area and that has put Allianz Lima 1-0 up against the 10-man of UTC. Wonderful stuff, half an hour into the game. Brilliant stuff there from Lima. Here we see it, Canella with a lovely ball into Formento. Takes a couple of touches to beat his man. Comes into the area on the left foot. Keeper wasn't expecting it. Great finish. 1-0 Lima. Okay, Landari has it to Formento. Mayer. Into Mazurek. Saloon is on the overlap. Oh, he's tell you what, he loves a shot. Okay, and we are into half time. 1-0 up against the 10 men. I'm going to calmly tell them, make sure we've got well, that cup is ours at full time. They were, you know, listening, so that's a start. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to say anything else. I think it'll just confuse them. The referee has given out a fluttering of yellow cards after the red, so I'll have to watch that. I'll kick off then. Mayer's flinged it out left to Landauri. Landauri flings it all the way out right to Canella. Canella up the line to Saluna. Saluna back in field to Landauri. Truly on the overlap because it'd be a goal from kickoff. Oh, good save from Rodera and Queena puts it out for a throw. Okay, I'm going to make a sub because Trulio is absolutely knackered. He must have picked up a bit of a knock. But Vladimir Hood can come on. That's not a problem. He's played there numerous times. No pressure. No pressure in the cup final. Saluna was fouled by Quina. And it's a yellow card. Another yellow card. That's quite a few now. Okay, coming up to 10 minutes to go. And I'm going to make a sub. Landari is going to come off. And Rodas is going to replace him. Hood with a throw. Into Duclos. Back up the line to Hood. Infield to Rodas. The sub. Into Mazurek. Canella. Salahuna is going to be there. He's found him. Can he put Canella in again? He can. Canella back to Saluna into Mazurek. Mazurek with a shot, it's blocked well. Mayer picks it up. He finds Canella back to Mayer, out to Mazurek, again to Mayer. Oh, and it's a poor pass and it's cleared well. Mane has won the head, but it's fallen to Zier Bellion. He's gone back to Bogardo, and that's the end of the highlight. Okay, there is about a minute and a half left to go, so my final sub is going to come on. It's going to be Joel Rodriguez, and he is going to come on for Romero just because he's on a yellow card. This has got to be the last highlight. Quina into Maldonado. Back to Quina. There's 10 seconds left. Maldonado, Quina. Chico, poor pass. Rodriguez picked it up, but he's given it away to Ger Bailon. Blow the whistle, ref. Maldonado with a long ball forward. It's got to be easy for Esteli. Take your time. Take your time. Blow the whistle. Come on. They're whistling in the crowd. Get it over with. Saluna 
Infield to Mazurek. Just keep the ball, guys. Retain the possession. Mazurek brings it over halfway into Rodas. Back infield to Mazurek. To Canella. And that is it. Get in there. We are back-to-back -back winners of the Torna del Inca. Another piece of silverware for the cabinet. I don't think we've got the money to build another cabinet or even get it polished. But we'll cram another trophy in there. Unbelievable stuff. Really happy. Not the best game in the world, but... A win in a cup final is a win in a cup final. Saluna, the guy that I got in, he was an amateur. Bought him in 32 on a free. He has been playing absolutely amazing as a right wing back. We have absolutely boshed them. They didn't have a shot on target. Great work. Hopefully the board are going to be happy with that. Well, I don't see why they wouldn't. There we go. We lift Torna del Inca. We win in the playoff final. That's three in a row because they didn't hold it in 2015. We're given 150k. Oh, I've entered the Peru Hall of Fame. There I am. Cultured left foot. Whee. Three times in a row. The board are happy. Pizarro de Clans. Flavor. Oh, yeah. By the way, I'm keeping on Claudio Pizarro because we're one of his favourite clubs and he's our favoured personnel. So when his contract is up, I'm going to get him. More for sentimental reasons than anything else, but I'm going to get him. And for finishing bottom and second bottom in the Torna del Inca overall table, you get points deducted going into the proper season. It's crazy. Absolutely crazy. As this episode um, was a bit short, we'll have a look at the finances. As you can see, we're now only 60 grand in debt. This is unbelievable. We've already made half, nearly half the money that we made for the entirety of last season. Um, income is a million, expenditures 589. I think we're going to have to rename the series soon. So comment below with an idea for a new name for the series. The Copa Libertadores draw was done and we have got Liga del Quilto who actually put us out of the qualifying phases in the first season. So that would be an interesting game. Um, they should beat us. Looking at their players, I mean, well, no, I can't see them, I've got to scout them. But, yeah, they've got generally better players than us. We'll have to see how that goes. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Hit that like button if you did. Subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. And I will see you, hopefully, tomorrow. Um, I will probably play the home game against Liga de Quilto and come back for the second round, second leg against Liga de Quilto away. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Hit that like button. Look me up on Twitter, at CulturedF, and I will chat to you in a bit. Cheers.